Hi everyone, this is Rachel. I am just coming here today to do a flip through of my Week in the Life album for 2021. If you don't know what Week in the Life is, it's an Allie Edwards project um, where you document things for an entire week in your life. Um, she's been doing it a long time, um, but it's fairly new to me. I've never really taken the time to do it. So this year, I bought the 6x8 album. This album came with the page protector. She did offer another album. I got the Allie Edwards Week in the Life kit. I got the Paisley Press mini kit. I bought several stamp sets. And I also got the um, digital downloads that she has for Week in the Life, which includes uh, days of the week that you can print and also um, Photoshop templates that has phones on it, um, computer screens, tablet screens, things like that. I also... Uh, did the prep day and I highly encourage anyone who's doing any projects like December daily week in the life things like that she does a prep day a lot of times for these projects and it's only five dollars and you will get lots of content lots of ideas and also lots of digitals so it's well worth the money so let's dive in I actually put this on the outside of my album. It is a chipboard piece from the kit. It does have the year on it. So I wanted to make sure that I used this one. And there was one other piece that had the year on it that I want to also make sure that I use. Things that I don't use, I can always carry over to another year. Um, but things with the uh, year or date on it, I want to make sure that I use those. So let's jump in. So here is the title page for my album. This was a digital download in the prep day class. Um, Allie did hers where she put uh, tissue paper and strips across in different colors, like in a rainbow order. I had this tissue paper in my stash as polka dots, as you can tell. I thought it was really cute, so I decided to do this one. The Also, um, in the kit, you've got this circle. It says Week in the Life, but this outer white circle is actually from the Prep Day class, another free digital, and it says Life Captured, Recorded, and it has May 10th through 16th, 2021. Um, they also, she also provided one that did not have the date and it just repeated the words around. Uh, just in case you weren't doing Week in the Life on the same week. You can do it any week you want. This is just the week that Allie had chosen to do hers and I played along with it also. This red is flower die cuts or from a punch, from a Stampin' Up! punch because I needed to bring this off the background. Had I done more solid color like Allie did, that wouldn't have been necessary, but with the white, it blended in too much. So I also popped it up on Pop Dots. Also this cover page here, I did glitter. So I used the Tim Holtz Glitter Duster. And I don't know if you'll be able to see that but you'll see how it's just slightly glittery. Um, what I love about that is, you know, it doesn't come off. So that was a great uh, thing to add a little bit of extra to it. So then I did my reason why. This came from the prep day, I believe. And when I was saying about the digital downloads with the days of the week, they're similar to this. It's just all over the background. This reason why is a stamp I had in my stamp set. One little word, I believe, is where that came from. I used one of the hearts from the kit. 
and that's my reason why. And then here you'll see currently watching, and then on the back is currently listening. There's also several others. Those came in the prep day, and I decided to put it in the two by two pockets. Um, these are some of the things I'm watching. Allie, of course, and um, Prime. This actually came from packaging, from a package I received. But having Prime, of course, you have access to videos and things. So I thought that was uh, good to put in here. Uh, of course, I did not have enough to fill up the whole thing. So I used some fillers. This and this came from the kit. Uh, this was a stamp set that I purchased for a week in the life and it was all about weather which I thought I could really utilize because I work in emergency management so I work weather uh, related events as well and um, so like hurricanes I, that's what I do for a living I work these it's sort of like local FEMA in a way but it's nowhere near like FEMA I can tell you so I also used uh, a Starbucks um, coffee sleeve and punched that uh, just to fill in the gaps. Um, of course, this is round, so you kind of see through to the um, next page. Same thing on the back. Of course, I had those quarter circle pieces, so I used the, another one on the back side of those. This is from a sale ad. Um, and then this was the back side of that prime piece, which had, uh, that's where I put that second chipboard that has the year, um, right there. So I wanted to make sure that I used that. And this, I took a screenshot from Instagram. I thought it was so funny and I just wanted to include it. It says, I rescue craft supplies. I'm not a hoarder. I'm a hero. <laughs> so I loved that. I just thought it was funny. So throughout the album, I pretty much have the same layout throughout the whole album, which makes it easier. I will say having uh, access to Allie's uh, Facebook groups and stuff like that. Also, I got a lot of wonderful ideas from other people. Um, for instance, um, on these acetate pieces that came with the album, um, each, each piece has a tab with the day of the week. Let's see if you can see that. Yeah. Um, and then across the middle of it, it has the day of the week abbreviated. I added these um, pieces. I got this idea from uh, Morgan Beale, and she did the same thing. Um, these plastic diamonds and these chipboard diamonds. And I tried to just coordinate this, uh, one of the chipboard pieces to match the journal cards for each day because they were all different colors. So behind every single um, divider, sorry, lost my words for a second. I have a six by eight photo and actually two six by eight photos because you can, I have to have a six by eight on the back side of that. So when you flip it, there's my six by eight photos. There's my little sweet little Chloe. She decided that morning that she was going back to bed. She was not ready for me to go to work and went back. I had to find her and she was hidden in the covers. So yeah, that's rare because she's always raring to go. And then I used a pleather piece on each one um, on the outside for the texture. So it's on the outside of the uh, page protector. And then here's Chloe that night. Um, this is a fabric piece from the kit and chipboard heart from the kit. She was laying there. I know it's hard to see her because the blanket is the same color as she is. And so, yeah, it's tough, but uh, I hope you can see it okay. Um, so here, I'm sorry, I covered up. This picture is actually from the day before, but I wanted to include it because I was up in Jacksonville for my sister's wedding. This is my great niece. Um, so I covered up her face because I don't know how her family would feel about showing her. So to respect their privacy, I've done that. As you can see, I was very happy to be playing with her. <laughs> um, these word stickers and the black hearts are from the kit. These fabric pieces are from the kit. So here's the color, like I was saying, I was coordinating the color 
um, each day. So I was trying to, you know, take the blue with the blue and the blue. So this, um, you can see now this cork heart is from my stash. It is an Allie Edwards product, but it's not from Week in the Life. This is another acetate piece. This is some uh, circle pieces that uh, came in the kit. And so is the, this felt heart. And I just stapled it on for extra texture and added some uh, string through it. And here are the days of the week uh, printouts from the kit that I purchased from Allie. Um, I just put them on three by four and um, printed four of them to a page um, using acetate. So I'm not going to try to do that one handed. I will just flip. So that would, you would just see the backside like that. I did not put anything on the back here. I could if I wanted to go back and do that. I had done some shopping because I, my best friend retired. She was also my supervisor. It left a vacant opening that I have applied for. Now, I applied for this prior to this week. They still have not done interviews and it is June 13th. So I'm still waiting, but in the meantime, I had decided I'd feel better about the interview. You always feel good if you have a new outfit. So I went shopping on my lunch hour and actually found several good deals. So I got several items, uh, another core cart, that's receipts. Um, this was from my sister's thing. Um, these are tags from the clothes, the Liz Claiborne um, items actually had this twine, this, it's more like a cord, um, a thin cord that, um, the tags were on the clothes with. So I thought that would be nice to use that and just put it in here for future. Uh, again, as you can see the same color picture used another chip, uh, core cart from my stash, another circle from the kit. Another photo, journaling card. This, the, these cards here were for, from the Paisley Press. This is different also. And this is um, where I found this company called the Wander Club. And they actually, you buy things. It's sort of like a keychain in a way. You can hook it on your backpack or something. And they have tokens that you add to it. Uh, like states and national parks and countries and things like that. Um, as you can see right there, there's one of them. And there's some of the tokens. I know it's kind of hard to see right there. As you can see, there's another one. And I got that for my girlfriend for a retirement gift. I also picked up a couple of others. Got one for myself. And they also donate part of their proceeds to help feed children. So... I really like that. It, really good quality. Um, here's a, a quote card from the kit. Um, from the, the digital stamp set. I put that around here. This, this is very precious to me. It's in my office. Um, my mother made that. She hand crocheted this. And uh, she's been gone for a few years now. Um, so it's very special. And um, these are just some of my vintage cameras. Um, as you can see, I have I have the cameras all over the place in my office for now. Um, and that's one of the kitties that has adopted me. They show up at my house and don't leave. There's another one. He's been there for years. That's the two of them. She does not like him, though. She's always trying to run him off, and he won't go. He's like, I've been here longer. Uh, hibiscus are in bloom where I live. I live in Florida. so. And then I end each um, day with these three by eight cards. And um, let me back up a second because I just thought of something. These, these, um, I got this idea also from Morgan Beale. 
I'm going to give credit where credit's due when I can remember. Um, she also printed these out as three by four because I really didn't need them as a six by eight or a little larger um, because I had the uh, ones that came in the album. So I thought I would just do it them as three by four like she did. And she did the same thing where she just stapled some uh, pieces to it. So back to this. And I'm going to, I don't know how to pronounce her name, but I think it is Deneen Marie. Sorry if I butchered your name, but uh, she's uh, posted this idea to Allie Edwards' group. So I meant to put this as red and this as black, but I messed up. So I just went and did every day like that. And I staped the date. Um, down at the bottom and put the what the weather was like of course it was like that all week long I mean it was beautiful all week um, she also put the half circle acetate pieces that was um, extra an add-on these were an add-on also they weren't part of the original kit um, and I thought this was a good idea because I wasn't sure how I was going to use these and uh, I like this and gives it a little something extra that you can grab and put it back. And this was, these came with these cards. So I have this, and this is how I end my day each day. As you can see, here we go to Tuesday, more chipboard, um, and then six by eight photo, pleather on the outside, uh, chipboard heart here, uh, large photo. This is um, my energy drink, especially right now with working 10 to 12 hour days. I kind of need it because I'm not sleeping very well at night because I'm stressed with going through accreditation by myself, worried about getting the new position. I have no help doing her jo old job, my job, and trying to teach a new person. So it's it's tough right now. So anyway, this is this is my go-to, and it's it's got very little caffeine in it. That's why I like this. Some of what my days like meetings, um, another journal card, and as you can see, I did not fill out everything. You don't have to fill out all the prompts. So this has prompts like feeling, appreciating, enjoying, noticing, watching, reading, prioritizing, eating, listening, and wondering. So, I mean, you get these prompts. You can sit here and write. It kind of helps you come up with the things that you, you can put down for your day. Because I live by myself. I have, My kids are grown. I don't even see them that often. They live in other cities. Um, so, you know, my life looks totally different than someone who has a family and little ones and has a ton of stories. I don't always have a ton of stories. I work a lot. But this is good. It gives me a jumping off point. Um, what Tuesday, um, in the rise and shine in the morning, that's from the kid. It's a chipboard piece. And this is what my little Chloe does every morning. When I get up, she starts loving on me <laughs> and just makes my day. Um, another journal card. Oh, and each of the journal cards also has the date stamped on it. Um, I tried a key lime pie Kit Kat bar. I love key lime pie. I did not like that. That's not good. Mm -mm. It was not good. Didn't like that at all. So, as you can see, just stickers uh, from the kit, because there's word stickers that come with it. The 3 by 8 again. Um, this is five different stories of the day. Then we move on to Wednesday. Same thing. Acetate, chipboard leather piece oh and this is um if you've never seen this this is called weather shots and you can take a selfie or a picture of something and it will put what the weather's like where you're at the day um the date the time everything so um i thought this was really cool to add to the album one of the days i didn't want to do it every day uh Chai tea at work. I do not like coffee. Can't stand coffee. 
but I love my chai tea lattes. But, you know, they're a lot of calories, so I only have one here and there. It's I do not have them all the time, but this week I had two. <laughs> I was bad. Um, and my water. This is my typical day with water. I have water all the time, all day long. And um, this was from the work stamp set. She had a, a, um, a stamp set that was geared around working because, you know, that's part of our days. Um, and then this stamp right here, it says right now in the circle, that actually came from my one little word um, stamp sets. Um, class I was attending at the same time. And you can see I was all getting all ready. Um, journaling card. Wrote out my day. Uh, this is a fabric piece from the kit, kit Wednesday, uh, Workspace Wednesday, sorry. Uh, this was a meeting. I had to get off of this to get on this and then go back to this. <laughs> yeah, crazy. Um, this was an extra uh, from Allie. And I did, they had, she had this two different ways. This is me or this is us. Since it's, I live by myself. I just put this is me and just some journaling about who I am at this point in time in life. And this is a chipboard piece in heart from the kit. Same thing going through the day. You can see my crazy desk. I had to laugh because throughout the whole thing, you'll see my desk in all different stages. It gets really messy. I try to clean it up. It gets really messy. I try to clean it up. And it just goes back, back and forth, back and forth. And this is all this yellow is where I'm trying to highlight items of different plans and different things for the assessors to try and get through the accreditation. Someone keeps bringing in donuts at work, and I was good and did not have a single one. Not one. But I wasn't so good at lunch because I had pizza. But that's because I forgot my lunch at home. I packed it and left it at home. So I had, I had to go to Target for something, so... They have a Pizza Hut thing in there, so I picked up a pizza. Um, some supplement I'm trying at the park where I'm trying to, you know, I always leave for lunch or I try to always leave for lunch because my days are very long and I need the break. Um, so here we go, same, same format. This says this and that. and So you can compare if you wanted. Uh, orchid outside my office. In a tree. Um, I tried really, really hard to get myself in pictures this year. Um, or not just this year, I can say just in general in my scrapbooking because I look back on my older stuff. I'm not in them. You see my kids, you see my ex-husband, you see I'm not in the pictures because I'm always taking the pictures. No one ever took pictures of me. Um, and back then you didn't have phones in the ease of taking pictures. It was all you know, had to put film and camera type thing, and it's costly. Um, this came from the kit, and daily life, this is daily life for me. Work, work, work. Um, and But I did manage to get myself in there, and I set a timer, and I actually picked this up for getting us at the timer. So, but that's good, because it's showing how I'm always drinking my water. Uh, just a general picture of my desk and how crazy it gets, an acetate piece. This, today I did a little different because today, I mean, the layout's the same, but this is my friend's office next to me, and it's vacant. You can see nothing's on the walls. She's left, of course, some of the stuff's still there, but, um, I just did this because I'm getting nervous about the job. They sent out a questionnaire. That's what this is about to all the applicants to fill out. And I got really nervous over that. Um, I mean, I've worked there for 21 years. I know this stuff. But when you want something so bad, you're so afraid that they're going to give it to someone else, you know. Um, but we'll see how it goes. Like I said, they still haven't interviewed yet. So anyway, this is just me trying to stay positive, saying next year when I do Week in the Life, 
I'll be in this office. I'll be there instead. Um, went to lunch and I was very angry because someone had taken all their, there's more of the, they threw all their garbage on the ground. Every bit of it. I mean, garbage cans all over the place and they didn't throw it in a garbage can, threw it all on the ground. And there's more down here where you, that you can't see. And I picked it all up because I didn't want it to end up into the river and ocean and hurt our wildlife. So I picked it all up and threw it all away and then treated myself to an ice cream because I was absolutely angry at the person who did that. Um, just went through McDonald's and got an ice cream. Nothing great. Um, just more of my work. And I don't know if you can notice. It's like, what? Uh, 7.30? 7.35 in that picture. And I'm still at work. That's my desk. It's just, it was tough day. Very tough day. So here's the end. And here we go, four different stories for the day. Spider, see, I got another picture of me. I'm so proud of getting those pictures. Chai tea latte for the day. <laughs> and this was from the prep day class and I put it on this photo. And for me, stuff of life, yeah. So everybody loves their coffee and has to have their coffee. Mine's the chai tea. <laughs> Uh, this is on my desk. A lot of desk photos, as you can tell. Um, but this is um, a pencil holder my daughter bought me. And it's, I love owls. And, um, but this is the Harry Potter owl. And that cup that I'm always drinking out of, she bought that for me uh, before too. And as you can see, didn't fill out every spot on the journal card again. Um, you don't have to. They're just ideas. Some of the things I'm watching on YouTube. Took a quick break, went outside during work, took a photo of my shadow. It's Jeans Day and showing my favorite sneakers, my Bob's by Skechers. Love those. Didn't have enough to fill all the pockets towards the end. And um, so I used a filler card from a story kit. That's from the Paisley Press Kit. Had Chipotle. Oh, my God. And it was so good. Oh. Gas prices. I thought that would be good to include. Um, at the time, it was $2.85 a gallon. But when you have their app, you get $0.10 cents off. So, I paid $2.75. And I did like Allie had done. Looking into my office. I'm sitting there and looking out of my office, what my view is. So that's a conference room right across the hall. And that day I got everything out. So this is the table in the conference room. So if you walk in there, go to the right, there's the table. That's That was the view at the time. And we're getting ready for the Hurricane Expo in a couple of weeks. So I got that stuff out to start getting things together. Here's one of those templates I was talking about that was in Allie's um, stuff. I think the the package was 450 I believe and you got all of each of the days of the week of these which you could print you know full page or three by four like I did or on um, white cardstock um, anything I mean vellum however you want to do it you can do it so I did apps that I I constantly use um, from my phone. So this was an extra also outside of the normal layout. And I put some paper for my stash as a simple stories, and I believe it's called Heart. Uh, this is a fabric piece from Allie's kit, um, butterfly from the kit, and I stamped using the stamp set. Today is a perfect day to just be happy. And the typical, and here's a... Uh, Five things I was grateful for. Then we go into Saturday. So Saturday, as you can see, um, I went to the beach. You can kind of see the ocean there. And I've worked a lot of Saturdays. And this weekend, I said, I'm not doing it. I have to have a break. 
Um, so I really tried to relax and enjoy myself all day. And it was much needed. And I just enjoyed myself so much. And this is Memorial Island, where I live, which is dedicated to veterans of all the different branches of service. Um, and it's called Veterans Walk. That's the little bridge that goes over to the island. And I was taking a photo here on the rocks um, of the wildlife and, and different things on the rivers. And this is a fabric piece from the kit and sticker. Uh, they have lots of wildlife there. There's a, a good picture of rabbit there. And this is how I took the selfies. I used this. I, this I bought for everybody in my office a few years ago. I love this thing. And it's just little hands that hold your phone. And it stretches so you can actually turn your phone the other way. So I added X these in. They didn't do well for doing three by fours. So um, I just added extras in here. And this is chipboard piece from the kit. So I just set that on the rocks and set a timer and took a picture of me taking pictures with my DSLR. And then took a picture of this with my DSLR. This is where I worked on my week in the life in one little word that evening. Oh, and this is an owl up in the tree. And he moved before I could get my DSLR uh, ready to shoot. So I'm just showing how that's there. And I used some different filler cards for my um, story kits. Me at the island, quote card from the kit. Someone had this dog on the back of their truck and I just laughed. And apparently this person really tried to make people uh, laugh. And then this is some um, jumping off points to journal. Currently watching, trying, reading, eating, loving, and hoping. Then we get to Sunday. Another hibiscus, my little Chloe Bell. Um, she loves to run around and play. I clean offices on the weekends, which if I get this new position, I am no longer going to do. I have been doing this since my kids were little, and they've been groaning out of the house for a long time. So I'm ready to stop doing this, have weekends again. Played around with taking uh, pictures of my reflection in my glasses. Laundry, um, the kitty, and this was, I watched Allie's story chat, and everyone was taking pictures for their week in the life, and this lady forgot her camera and didn't have, didn't have the ability to take a picture. <laughs> and then, what happened and how I feel about it, and so that was a good story prompt. This is how I ended my album. This is the beach where I live. Uh, weekend views, it says. Um, we have beautiful, beautiful beaches here. And then this is actually a sunrise, not a sunset. So um, that's at one of the beaches. So if you have any questions or anything, feel free to ask. And I'll try to get back with you as soon as I can. And thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.